Here's problem 10-6. The end of a cutting cord on a gas-powered weed cutter is 0.15 meters in length. If the motor rotates at a rate of 20 revolutions per second, what is the tangential speed of the end of the cord? Let's take a look at the cord on a weed cutter. And let's consider some point A traveling around the origin, around this weed cutter like this. So we're told that the angular speed actually is 20 revolutions per second. Let's convert that immediately to radians per second. We know there's 2 pi radians per revolution. So the revolutions will cancel out. And we end up with 40 pi radians per second. Or if we calculate that out, 40 times pi. 125.7 radians per second. So that is our angular speed for any point on this weed, weed eater. So if we want to find the linear speed at a particular point, that's equal to the angular speed times the radius to that point. And in this case, the radius we're talking about is the radius of the weed eater, which is given as 0.15 meters. So our linear velocity at that point is going to be V equal to the angular velocity, 125.7 radians per second times 0.15 meters. And what is that? 18.85 meters per second. Oftentimes, radians is regarded as, in a sense, a unitless quantity. So we don't say meters, radians per second. We just kind of drop the radians and say 18.85 meters per second. That is the velocity of the point on the very end of the cord.